Hello and welcome back to a quick little video for my final thoughts on the game so far. I played a little bit more into the game than the video I put out on Tuesday. Uh, again, I'll apologize real quick. I think I'm getting a cold in the middle of May, which is driving me insane. You don't get colds in the summer. I don't know who I made mad, but anyway, moving on. I'm a little farther ahead in the game and uh like to uh, just talk quick right as I do one of these uh, story missions about how I feel about the game so far and what I think there could be like one or two things that you could do to make this game a bit better granted I'm also coming at this from the uh, mindset of playing games like Diablo Path of Exile uh, Torchlight 1 and 2 other games like that too and while this has a lot of really good trappings as far as compelling things to keep you want to keep coming back during the week, there's like glory things that reset every Monday. Uh, everything seems to be tile based, it's randomly generated every time you do a mission. The story so far, I mean, I'm personally getting into it. I don't know if you will. Granted, I don't come to these things for stories. You just kind of need a game where you can just do this and have some music or whatever playing in the background. And uh According to the coordinates you found Enjoy your enjoy it enjoy a nice afternoon of just mindless thinking and uh blowing things up. However, there's like one or two things that would be great. I could fix this to make it even better. Oh, I've got a new ability, I don't know what this does. Oh the missiles. That's fucking real cool. That's on a cool gun. Alright. I got a new gun, everything was a sword before, but these things are uh the weapon I'm using now is actually a better, like, damage, whatever you want to call it. Jesus, I'm destroying things here. But, okay, I did that bad. Let's just do this. Fuck you all. Slice you up. There we go. Alright. And one of the things that's right off the bat that I'm uh, a little disappointed with this is, yeah. Oh, you're blowing up a bunch of little enemies. It's real cool, but the only drawback is there's no, like, satisfying feel when you hit these things. Like, when you played uh, Vermintide, and that whole game is just you going up and shooting things. It, it The game is no fun if you're just sitting there having to hit things and you don't get a satisfying feedback from it. Oh, I'm overheating. Shows how much I paid it. I just got this, so... Know so much I'm paying attention. But when you play other games like Diablo, things explode, there's some good noise. I did find with the camera to rotate it. Blast alloy, you got some crafting stuff in this too. I haven't messed around with it too much. Because early access, this is getting a character wipe before the game starts, so if you played any other MMOs that have character wipes, you know that uh Playing a bunch of the game before the game actually comes out, when it gets reset, not worth it. Because you're just going to have to do... Oh, I didn't you're just going to have to replay everything you did before, and then you're like, well, this is boring, I don't want to do this anymore. Stop attacking me. Stupid, like, little late. I didn't kill him. Oh, this is annoying. Yeah, his voice acting is greatest in the world. Oh my Christ. The thing that bugs me too is, I don't understand the health bar in here. I mean, granted, there's a thing down here, compared to other games, like, again, I'm going to be comparing this a lot to Diablo because that's what I'm kind of going against, and if you're like, well, that's not fair because this is Diablo, if it wants to draw from any pool of people who are going to play games like that, Diablo's kind of like it, and so is in Path of Exile, where everything is clearly shown here, we granted Path of Exile kind of has a ball over here and a thing over here, but they're big and obvious. I don't know what any of this stuff is. I can mouse over it. Hell shield, great. Let's just suppress all oh, these resistances. That's fantastic. Whatever that means. It's just like a big thing in the middle. Like, I can just quickly see on the side of the screen as I'm sitting here trying to kill tiny little things. There we go. Missiles will fix everything. No, where was I? Uh, the UI stuff, that's kind of it. I mean, you can cu customize this stuff, too, if you want. 
Um, but combat, you need that, like, these little runt things here. I'm going to switch to this. They're tiny little things. And, yeah, there's a little bit of screen shake. But you're so, like, drawn out that it doesn't feel all that good attacking these things. To me. Yeah, a little screen shake and everything, but I don't feel like I'm really doing much in combat here. Diablo yeah, things popped, there's explosions. I got a Thule greatsword. Can I equip that now? I guess I'll back once the thing's over. Um, and also, like, elite packs here. We've got a thing down here. Like, again, comparing it to other games like Path of Exile or Diablo. Elite packs or champion packs are very easily distinguished between everything else here. Here you got a little icon over the head, and when everything's exploding in here, it's very easy not to see what you're doing. I can zoom in more, but it should just be easily distinguishable between all the trash you're fighting. Shoot the missiles, everything blows up. Oh yeah, got a... I really hate this thing. I don't know how much damage you do. I'm gonna get nailed. This grenade thing I have now does like so much like regen it stays on me for so long I'll probably scale it uh, three and I will hit four I guess I can't and right, I'll come in and hit you I'll just sit here go bashed him whirlwind knocked him down there's no real good feedback for what you're doing here hey they all died great I got a man implant and a shotgun from Mars. Fantastic. I guess I can equip that stuff when it's over. I'm regening health. But other than those equips, like the sound ain't great. I mean, I have it a, a little quiet here. Just because. I don't want to. I'm recording all of this through OBS. It would be awful. You would be able to hear me with the levels I've got. Shut up. There we go. Yeah, there's like the sound is so quiet. I think it's done. Graphical stuff. When I hit this, it exploded, and the uh, ship I was in, that thing turned into a pillar. Um, other than that, I'm really liking everything else I'm doing so far in this game. They just tweak a few, like, force, like feedback. Like I've said before, sounds good. Satis if things explode in a good way instead of just like this flash of light I don't feel it's it's a little I feel a little detached other than that I'm liking it uh, I've got I don't know what these are but I'm I'm just destroying everything kill the old oh, Britain all right the sword ain't great I can't equip it till the thing's over but also, early on, I know that some of the talents you can actually run faster. Well, how these games always end up boiling down is you're just straight up killing things as fast as possible, running through the zone super fast. I don't feel that this is one of those games that you can. Granted, I haven't played as much. That can easily change. I'll kill this guy. I just completely missed. That's fantastic. I have 20 seconds to kill this thing. There's cool little things like this. Like, hey, you gotta chest that's here you got a timer to kill it they got some good things going here uh yeah thank you for loading it I'm gonna try to cough but i'm gonna try to hold it <coughs> excuse me i don't know where the cold came from i hate it i switched armor out and the if you remember in the other game there was uh there was uh like a leap ability i had this thing i'm using now it uh has rockets I'm just, this is the first time I'm trying it. I don't think I'm a fan of it. I think I'm going to try to find armor that lets me do that jump slam because jumping in on enemies and destroying them. I like that. That's fun. Hey, Nurgle Hive, huh? Alright, well, I'll blow you up. Fuck you, Nurgle Hive. And a little issue. Whatever. I killed the creep, I guess. I don't know. Again, looking at all this stuff with arms reach. I'd like to look more into this, like some story stuff. I do have called 
Um, I don't know where my book went. I got like just in the beginning of it. It was done by some famous author. Is the Inquisitor like trilogy, whatever you want to call it? I'm forgetting names. I feel real bad. I can't. I don't remember where I put the book. Just started with that. Seemed interesting. I'll shoot you uh, some missiles. The missiles. I guess it's cooldown. It's insane. I really do not like this armor. Just hit this button a bunch. Things die. Fuck you. Big ball. What's up? I don't know what you're summoning. I don't like it. I don't think I'm gonna finish it before. No, I did kill. One. All right. You're not gonna slam. I guess I can't. Wait, what was this glowy purple thing? Oh, that is so far away. I'm gonna get to this mine first. Oh, I am stunned. This is unfortunate. I feel that this is one of the high. I'm not very fast. Nope, this Captain, is. Metro Dorotha Lamer is definitely. I keep not trying there. to find this woman. That's quite unfortunate, Inquisitor. Inquisitor. At least I've eliminated the local threat. So this whole journey but hasn't been a I don't have to go home yet. Time. I can turn around and go look at the other place. I just wish I was able to run faster. Like, I don't know how fast Inquisitors run compared to other things in Warhammer. So maybe it's like, he's an Inquisitor. He's not going to run fast. I know he's not a space hole. Those things, they don't move fast, but... Ah, damn, stupid minds. I'm not even paying attention, so... I messed around a little bit with some of the other classes, but again, everything early game is kind of the same. I'm not noticing too much of a difference, and again, I'm not getting completely involved because character. And I do not want to play everything I just started again because you just get real tired of doing it a second time. It's what kills me the most when I'm doing like early access or beta stuff for MMOs. Back when I used to do it a lot. Just finish doing this and find the other hive. Oh god. I, I'm not coordinated enough to use two fingers on my, my mouse, whatever it's called. I feel I wish this you nailed know, the mic. I wish this was faster. I mean I'm going at an okay clip. There's talents that you can go to run faster. I just not ha I have not unlocked them yet, and I don't know if I can for the class I have. Fuck you. And you destroy. And now I can exit, but first, I want to kill everything else here. I like that they let you. Like, hey, the mission's over, but you don't have to leave just yet. You can, uh. Oh, Christ. Uh, three. I got destroyed. Oh my god. I don't know what overwhelm means, but I don't like it. There we go. Give me my shield back. This thing is overpowered. 30 seconds at last. And again, this stuff feels ambiguous. I've got. Is this what it's going to heal to? I don't know. Oh, hit zero. I will get another one. And again, the cover system seems weird because I don't want to stop moving. I don't want to sit in cover. Because that's just not fun. I wish I had. Here we go. Destroy you, you stupid laser things. I hate you. Kill you. And explode! You. This is the end of the mission. Destroyed. Alright. Is there anything over here worth getting? Doesn't look it. Alright. Mission done. That's how all the missions go. They're pretty fast. I mean, this one was 14 minutes. It was a bit longer than all the other ones. I do like this. I'm gonna get this little, like, loot box after every mission. Every time you level up, you get another one, too. These things are pretty straightforward, as far as, like, damage stuff you can get. It says, like, this thing is this much better. Yeah, I don't... Two, plus two quality equipped main implant. I like that chain sword. I might equip that. Hit continue. Hey, look, I leveled up again. Hit the button, get some more stuff. Ooh. Got an attribute points. I'm going to assume this... Ooh. Tool great axe. Nice. Influence, yet. Yeah, this is that weekly thing, I believe, that resets... Legendary Carnage, Critical Hits. 
Each kill provides critical hit chance. You get like perks unlocked. It's pretty handy. I don't know what that does. I'll go take a look before I end the video, just so you get a little bit more of a taste of what this stuff is. I do have available points. These are things I have unlocked for me right now. I did get some resistance. I'm going to go up to this just so I get damage reduction from standing still. I want to just never die. This is dumb. I'm never going to be in cover, but I have to get to that to get to this. Lots of trees, just movement stuff. Yeah, here's the movement tree. I can't unlock it until I'm rank 13, and I wish I was able to do that sooner, but other classes probably have access to it earlier than I do. We'll go back to defense. Uh, this is just other elemental resistance stuff. I might get to that at some point, but I'm just going to keep going up this until I get to that. I'm sure there's better people who know how to optimize better than me, but I'm not trying too hard because, again, this is early on. I can undo the attribute I just did. I cannot reset the one I had from earlier, so keep that in mind when doing this stuff. Um, we will set two. This thing is way better. We'll equip that. Set one. I want this sword because I'd rather be a chainsword dude. Way cool. Better implant. That sword is worse. This is not better. Stun mine. No. <clears throat> Excuse me. The heroic deeds. Ooh, I can. I can't click that yet. So I don't have the thing unlocked, it looks like. I'm assuming once you get like maxed out on these things, you actually get these perks, which are pretty hand pretty cool. I like that. Little things like that can keep you more interested and in wanting to keep playing the game. I wish this thing would be in a different spot or would go away when I'm in this menu. But that's just me. But yeah, that's just a quick look again at this. Um, maybe that'll help you decide whether or not you want to get into this. There's a few gripes I had, and maybe they don't mean anything to you. I did not try any co-op stuff, but you know how co-op goes when you don't have a group. Everyone just runs as fast as they can, destroying everything, and you're just kind of like, well, I want to kill things too, but they're just way faster because they're objective-based, but whatever you come to these games for. But anyway, I hope that was helpful, and when the game comes out, I believe on Tuesday, you'll have a little bit better idea of whether or not this game's for you. Uh, but yeah, that's it for us here at Hobby Fist. Uh, thank you all for watching. You know the spiel, like, favorite, comment, subscribe, tell your friends. Any input you got about things I may have said wrong, I don't want to be state anything if you can correct me I'd appreciate it or if you have any other input or suggestions um, love to hear from you but for everyone here thank you all for watching have a good night we'll talk to you soon